We now, they told us to reapply that day. We stayed over. We were in Abuja and the plane crashed. We now, they told us to reapply that day. We stayed over. We were in Abuja and the plane crashed. Plane crash, you don't go see yours. Welcome back to my channel, guys. Shout out to Flip and Bunny on that one. So, guys, um, if you think celebrities are having it all easy, all wonderful, all, all glamorous all the time, man, you're getting it all wrong. Our first MTV Europe Music Awards hmm. in Abuja, myself, Paul, Jude, uh, Ayo Anima Shao, and his brother. These guys you see flying private jets, flying this country today, Europe tomorrow, America the next day, UK. Well, I'm going to talk a lot about this. You guys know the story of Kobe Bryant and the daughter and all that. Shit. Well, we, we, we don't pray for that. The photographer, what's his name again? Shola. Uh, Shola. Uh, but God has a reason. And it's more like a testimony. We got to Abuja on, on Monday. The award was on. We don't pray for that. We pray for long life. We live long to enjoy our money. The story of this square is quite different. That is quite different than that of Grace, guys. Um, this square revealed Peter specifically came online to say the so so little plane crash that happened on 10th December 2005 was actually a flight that they had a ticket to board it, but they were denied. They were denied. All of us had our returns, but we actually went with one person who was not traveling with us to say this person will collect it and bring it, but we need to come back to Lagos. Ubi, it was a Sosoliso flight that crashed. Visa then. They were supposed to catch um, a flight to uh, Abuja, and um, I mean, it was from Abuja to Port Harcourt, uh, to Abuja, that was the route, but they were, from, they were supposed to go from there to Copenhagen in Denmark for a on our world. We, uh, we travel to Abuja to get a Cop Copenhagen, right? Copenhagen, that's Denmark. Yeah, right? Denmark, yeah. To get, yeah the, to get the visa, the, 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 the embassy was in Abuja. That's the same award. The, the award we went to was the one freshly ground one. Yeah. Yeah. So if I remember, so we got to Abuja. I won't lie to you. But they were denied. And you guys know what this means, guys. We, we, we like play pro well, we don't, I don't have to talk long about this, but believe you me, this is just God at work. No, oh, that's just God at work. God at wonders, guys. Um, he made this known on a live um, interview with um, Obi Franklin. They denied us that very on Tuesday. We were denied. We go to Abuja on Monday. No, they denied us on Monday. We took the first line. They denied us. Our mind was to go. Submit passport, then they'll tell her to come back as usual. Few days time, then maybe one person will remain in Abuja. But all of us had our return ticket. And that will be frankly, shout out to you. You've been doing a wonderful work interviewing these celebrities. It makes us know how real it is. So he also picked up, Mr. Peter also talks about some issues, about some other things, and I wouldn't like to talk long on this video. So stay tuned, watch the end, give her a thumbs up on this one, like, share, subscribe, and see you in the next one. So. Moment, moment, we subscribe a big guy. YouTube do the easy, I swear that. Hey, it's not it. It's still there. Chop, 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 Ubi, it was a Sosoliso flight that crashed. I remember the oh. same ticket we had was the same plane registration number. But when we got there, they didn't give us. When I, they told us to reapply that day. We stayed over. We were in Abuja and the plane crashed. Wow. So if I, instead of me to say, oh my God, uh, I felt really bad. Mm -mm. They say God works in wondrous ways, and this was that was one of them. Hmm. 
Yeah. Wow. So we've been denied visa many times. Don't get me wrong. With your wow. big name, go to American embassy and say they must give you visa. Nobody will give you. you know. it did, I've been to the, the last time I went to American visa, <laughs> I was shocked. Normally, of course, we had normal this VIP treatment. This time, they say no VIP. My brother, Q. What's part? Say people they look you like ah, no be no be Mister P B this. My yeah. brother, you know, even get you know if you, only only me there. You know if you, they say they pretend maybe don't your phone. You know, get a phone. You are just a family. So I see, I've seen. I don't want to. You know, I've seen relations calling me. Oh, yeah. Every day when they fly, blah blah. When they send us money, I say, do you think I fly because once I fly, money, they, money, money, they fall from heaven. I mean, that they're, they're inside the plane, I go meet God, collect the money, put it inside the plane, then come down. He never called me and wished me Johnny Mercy. Mm. I don't know if you understand. Yeah. You're calling yeah. me to tell me you're seeing me on private jet. Oh, yes, I fly private. Fine, I understand, but hello? Mm. I want to see you where they ground better pass me than me where they up. I risk my life. If it happen anytime. Mm. You understand? So mm. people shouldn't be thinking, every time people think about success, they think, even the Aliko don't go through that they see so. You think he sleeps? In the mm. doubling hustle. You understand? Yeah. So for me, I just feel if, if you're out there looking at successful people, the first thing you need to ask yourself is not, don't forget about the life they are living. Ask yourself what they must have gone or been through before getting to this level. There's, there's a lot of sacrifice. There's been a lot of pressure from family. You know, the first people go first, begin to ask for too much in like your family. They don't want to yeah. know what they go through. At all. You understand? And then go yeah. figure in front of them. And then go demand. In fact, they, 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 they get. And then. They, all right. So. <laughs> club owners want to know vex, but they tell them that. No, no, they do So let's talk about local content. After a successful mm. uh, music career, why do you think we are still behind with producing cinematic uh, music videos locally in Nigeria? I know Not you, you guys shot video, even, even you, movies. Yeah. You guys shot mm -hmm. a lot of your, your videos in South Africa. Right? We started it. You started it. Yeah, started. You, you started shooting your videos in South Africa. Why do you think we're, we're still, you know, to shoot those kind of videos that you would like and say, wow, this is a video? You know, a um, few years back when we still had. Uh, China O, I don't know if you remember. China O. China O was one of the where people shook it there before MTV and Co came. And if you watch then, China O where anytime they are playing South African videos, we have the song, but we don't have the videos. Right? They have they don't even have the song hundred percent, but they have that video. Their video is like top notch. So one day I look at it, I was like, okay. Guys, let's look at these guys. Their videos are top notch. I mean, during that period, they anytime they do a word and blah blah, they are the old, they are the ones that will always win the best video categories, mm. right? And these people, they have the equipment, but they are not even using it that much. I'm telling you, even till today, if you watch a South African movie and a Nigerian movie, you can tell. Mm. Like I was watching Queen of Sono recently on Netflix. I don't know if you see, guys, look at yes. watch it. It's international standard. I don't, you won't even believe it's Africa. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So these people, they have the equipment. We don't. Even right now that we have it, but there's something wrong about Nigeria weather. I don't know. Yeah. Even my phone will be, you, you know, they, if you take a picture with your phone abroad, mm. you take a picture here in Nigeria, there's, the qualities yes. are different. Yes. Really, really, I don't really know good. where this thing is coming from. I'm being honest. So we, we, we so far so good. That's why most of us, me, I still shoot in Nigeria, but I still shoot outside. I mix both of them. Mm. Once it's a song that I need that Niger flavor dance, I'll take it, I'll bring it here. Once it's something I need, I'll, I'll take it out. And again, the problem we actually have sometimes shooting in Nigeria is power. Um, the environment. Um, you go, sometimes you want to shoot on the street, but the people will not allow you. They will block the road. Um, or the most settle so the last time we KC come here and I have a million naira and give us, so, you know, Mr. P, you are, you go give us two million for where? You know what I'm saying? So those are things. So for me, I would say, we local content 
in terms of satisfying Nigeria, mm. Africa, we've done that. But have we satisfied uh, the rest of the world? Not 100%. Mm. 